Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's about DT here, and welcome back to Let's Challenge Final Fantasy Solo Fire Challenge. This is part 14. Uh, before I start, I just want to show you the uh, shirt I'm wearing right now. It's um, it's the uh, what's it called uh, Bob Marley shirt. Um, we still come together and uh, create music and uh, love. Yeah, that's awesome. I got that from across the street about a month ago or such. Uh, I got a couple of um, what's it called uh. Not really braces, but like, um, I'm not sure what they're called, um, but yeah, this one says music equals life, and it really does, it's awesome, and this one says over it several times, see? So yeah, it's really cool, um, Hot Topics, you know, oh, there's a lot of good stuff, and it's a nationwide thing, um, their stuff is a bit pricey, but, um, shoot, I was able to afford it, and, um, Shoot, if you like style sets, yeah, I recommend you, um, hit them up, you know, well, at your local, um, Hot Topics, if you have one. So anyway, last time, uh, yeah, here's everyone's stats, by the way. Last time, we tried to, def well, I tried to, stop doing that. I tried to, um, what's it called? I tried to, um, defeat Tiamat, but it didn't quite work. So, run from this. Wow, I start and I get punched in the nuts for 120 damage. Haha. <laughs> Let's go ahead. Let's see if I can actually pull it off. Let's see your tent. I'm gonna spend a few minutes trying to find um one of them T-Rexes, and if I can't find them in a few minutes, then let's call it good. Tyro. He hits me for 61 damage. And then he only hits for eight. I guess he's a bit tired from hitting me. Haha. -ha. Which yeah, let's go ahead and grind up some more. Chest try first, run from this crap. Cause this crap makes no sense, Roman. Roman, this is very bad. Oh Nico, I thought you was going to be bad here in Liberty City. Did I not warn you, cousin? Roman, you never told me it was back. You just told me about the women in the titties and how Tiffany sucks like a vacuum. Haha. <laughs> it's funny. Okay. I don't know why the sand things just run away. They're... I, last time I checked, I think they're a good opponent to go up against. So yeah. No. Holy crap. Run away, please. Run. That is painful. So I guess I'm not going to have any luck um, doing that. And unfortunately, I can't like cut out any part of this challenge because one of the rules say I have to record everything. So unfortunately, I can't cut this out. I need to delete some footage and do that. Actually, you know what? I'll be right back. I'm going to go ahead and delete some of the parts I already uploaded. Well, not off my channel, but like off the hard drive. Hopefully, it'll stop this uh, lag and such, so I'll be right back. Alright, I am back. As you can see, that's the exact place, and let me just show you that everyone else's stats is still at zero. Yeah, what good are they gonna do me at this point, you know? I mean, sure, I could, like, revive them and then, like, put me out of front and, like, you know, defeat some strong enemy or such, and they level them up a couple levels, but really, who's, um, who's gonna chance that, you know? Well, you could, but I'm not going to do that. So yeah, let's go ahead and go heal up, actually. I got plenty of tents. Which, yeah, I deleted, like, like, a couple of gigabytes off of, um, the memory, you know, that's a lot of, um, you know, unnecessary space. But it didn't really seem to do anything with this lag. In fact, it looks like it's happening more frequently. It's like, must use space in order to work. Otherwise, it makes no sense. Wow, he deleted, uh, he deleted memory off his hard drive that was going to work for him. That made no damn sense. Wait a second, he's going to hit me for eight. Well, not that time. Because I know it's, you know, last time I fought these two earlier in this um, video, 
Yeah, he did 61 damage and then Tyro did 8 damage. That Tyro did 38 damage. And. It's like you can predict what's gonna happen, and. Yeah. Well, I guess the Sandworm is not too much of a threat anymore. He only did 1 damage. Which, well, yeah, I need to figure out what causes this shakiness. I've never seen it. I, I haven't seen it happen in anyone else's uh, case, you know? Of course, I am using Banny Cam, so yeah. But I thought Banny Cam was way better than this, in my opinion. But that's alright. Not bashing it, just saying. But that's alright. Uh, I should probably go ahead and put a tent up. Now, no, my luck, I'll get my strike first, and I will die. Chest strike first, eh? At 228 damage, I mean, that's... Insane. Same amount of damage like every fight. Like, the three fights we've had with this pair of enemies. The first attack on Tyro was 4 hits, 228 damage, as you saw. Like, what are the odds of that happening, you know? I don't get it. Shoot, I don't even remember how much health that had to start with. I probably got, like... I don't even, I don't even know, like... A 10-point boost or something. I think I was at like 690-something. And... Please run. Alright. Actually, I'm just gonna go ahead and start using heals. It's uh, faster that way. And tent. Alright, now that we're leveled up... My, uh, strategy this time is just, uh, going to be, uh, try and, uh, destroy, um, Tiamat as fast as possible because no, my luck means it's not going to work. And, um, I'm going to need to try to run from everything that I can and get to Tiamat as fast. These guys can paralyze. But not that time. I never knew until, like, you know, a part or two ago, well, last part, that um, guards could actually paralyze. I had no idea. I thought only the undead could do that, you know? Actually, I think the crawl is not undead because um, either that or he's immune to it, you know? Immune to a harm. So, yeah. Yeah, part 14. Wow, it took me 54 parts to get done with the solo white mage charge. I imagine how much. how long it's going to take me for the. Black Mage Challenge. That is going to be insane. I'll probably save that for last when I get like tons of subscribers. Hey, how I'm going last though? That's annoying. Oh god, throw a heal up. I might as well. Yeah. If it's like at least 20 points to help the off, I'll most likely put a heal up. Going to try and run. I don't know if the wizard mummies can put you to sleep. I know they can... I don't know if they hit harder or not. I know they're worth more golden experience, though. I think they're a thousand golden experience each. And I can't run from blue dragon, so... Yeah. And blue dragon missed on the first go. But then that time he hits. And then I kill you. You hit me, I kill you. It's like Jefferson Davis. I mean... Well, yeah, he's on Facebook, by the way. Baby Davis. You shoot me, I kill you. In Wolf 3D. And he, he said something, I think last year or such, or... The end of, uh, 2000... No, wait. It was last year. Let's go redo Wolf 3D and Ultimate Doom. Is in, like, his voice from those... Videos? I think his voice is a bit different in Ultimate Doom than, uh, Wolf 3D. I still like his Wolf 3D voice. It's pretty cool. It's like... I'm in charge. And I was like, hey, everybody, I'm just... A, I'm like another... I'm just like you, you know? I mean, I like, I definitely like, I still like his voice today, but yeah. he make a really good English professor, it's like... Hey, imagine if he did poetry, and he did narration before. I haven't been able to find any of the videos on YouTube recently. I should have, like, watched his, um, like, listed his uh, narrations of, like, I think my little poetry stories on YouTube, so yeah. Weapon, we got this damn Bane sword a second time. Now, do not screw this up run from these guys because they are bad. Ah, that's 19. I'll go ahead and save my, um, 
heals. Manticore! They can poison with Stinger. It doesn't kill you or paralyze you, don't worry. And even if they do sting, I mean, shoot. All it does is like a pathetic two points of health, of damage. Now, these guys hit way harder than I would be worried. But I'm not worried, you know? It's like, what poison? Two damage per turn. Uh, okay. What's that? What is two points of damage? Baby, don't sting me. Don't sting me. No more. I would try to kill these bastards. Boom! I thought these guys had like 200 health or something. Uh, they're, they're worth 1,218 gold experience each, huh? Awesome. I'm not even going to try and, um... Um, I'm not even going to try and go for any of the stuff in here. I'm just going to go for the, um... Boss. I'm going to run from this. That sentry does a hell of a lot of damage. Of course, I think the sentry is a sentry gun, so it's like... It's like guards like... Boom! And then sentry guns like... Or like Uzi. It's like, guard. Sentry, boom! Ah! Shot in the belly. Or boom headshot. It's like, guard is just... You know, you know, he's just, you know, tapping me. Okay, time, time to shoot and kill him. Boom! He falls off and dead. Yeah. Man, I can come up with a lot of good jokes off screen, but when it's time to record, I don't have anything. Ultimate Mantoid, please teach me how to be funny. Okay, I'll try to teach you how to be funny, but it kind of comes naturally. Well, naturally, sort of went out the window when I start recording. It went out the window about 12 minutes ago, buddy. Well, it sucks to be you, Mount D18. Okay. Piss off. <laughs> Not really. <sighs> okay. And uh, the wizards run. There we go. They can stun you, and I think they they hit much harder than the vampire. So yeah. Okay. So yeah. Here we go. Monster strike first. It's gonna kill this dude. Of course he poisons me. Why wouldn't he? Manticore doesn't sting me, but when there's just one enemy, apparently the less enemies there are, the more of a chance of a freaking poison. If they can even poison you. Imagine trying to. Now nah, let's go ahead and do this again. Imagine trying to unicycle across or like, you know, ride your bicycle across this narrow bridge. It's like, um, like if there's no sign. Of course there's just one left and I can get poisoned. Why not? It's like Fear Factor, like way back in the day. It was like, it was a like game show slash reality show. Not really reality, um, it was a, uh, it briefly came back in 2012. But there was supposed to, well, there was going to be another season in 2013, but still got canceled. I don't know why it got canceled. I guess it just didn't really, um, hold, hold up to expectations. I remember there was one episode that you had to be on, like, the edge of a, um, it took, like, uh, you won't be worried about this. Anyway, there was, like, a edge. I'll let this, uh, play out. There was, like, you know, back in, like, 2002 or three. There was like a side, there was like this narrow edge that you had to go like way, like at least 50 feet away or such, or was it 150 feet? Has these plants stuff, you did have a harness for safety, and you had to like make it all the way to the end. There was like, I think like the first person fell, but I think there was one person that did in like a minute 30 seconds, I don't know. Or like a minute 15, I forgot. The first time they had to go under like a helicopter, they had to get out of a helicopter, get under this, like the jump hang from um, Ninja Warrior, except you don't have the, the uh, trampoline, go under and go back around. You had to do it like the fastest time, or like, not the slowest time to move on. Then you have the like shoot targets, and you have like horse rectums to eat or such, and then the third stunt, you were like 100 feet up in the air. That's like the average or like the least amount of distance from the ground for these air stunts. You had to crawl across the, um, the edge, the narrow edge. And it's kind of like the ledge walk from Ninja Warrior 6, second stage. And then you had to get to like, you had to hop off like this little, um, rail to, um, South Clock. Anyway, enough of that. It's related to Ninja Warrior, but I like Ninja Warrior a lot more. So, Tiamat, you sneaky bastard. Time to die. 
think you're gonna win this time? Think again, I have defense. Actually, I don't really think it does much against the attack. So let's go ahead and start pounding away. Okay, we'll just use that Bane. Cause, um, hey, Tima doesn't really hit that uh, hard, so yeah. It's the, it's, oh, yes! I was about to say, it's their, his abilities. He has Poison, Thunder, I think Blizzard, I think Blaze. I don't know what others, but I know those are four he has. I mean, he also hit multiple times. But even the critical hit, I think it's like maybe like 97, 100, something, I don't know, but with all this armor, I mean, their abilities are worse. So the fact we don't have mute or anything to cancel out those um those spells or no that spells abilities or we don't have like any antis to block that out. Let's see poison. Yeah, they already said poison. Yeah, it's really bad. I mean, you can see that in the last video that thunder does over 200 plus, well over 200 plus damage. I think it's like 203 too. Yeah, that's painful. Nonetheless, we are out. We are done. Holy crap. And we still have time to grind. Okay, let's not be stupid. Let's go ahead and put a tent up. And that way, in case we do try to take the Ankylo out, why not? The red one. Did I just do that? You mean to tell me it only took me one turn? To take out Red Ankylo. Wow. Or Ankylo? I don't even know. Please uh, let me know in the comments down below. Or message me or PM me or such. And let me know if I'm uh, saying that right or wrong. Okay. Okay. We are in the airship. Okay. We have got all four of these orbs. Time to go to the Temple of Fiends. Yeah, right. See what I think I was going to do that? No siree. I'm not stupid. I'm not going to do that. Okay. Let me go ahead and save. But there is an area I have to go... Oh, let's go ahead and uh, do that real quick before time runs out. Let's see here. Stop right here. Tent. And we'll go. Wow. No, don't fight these guys. They're dangerous. Well, nothing I can really do about it now. Yeah, critical hit. Both those tigers did critical hits. They have. I don't know if they're critical hit. They're critical. The, the luck. Their luck must be out the window. Or the Red Nova Jerry must not apply to them really. Much. And the, these cat men also have pretty good chance of critical hitting you too. This is like the most dangerous um, combination of enemies to ever have, it seems. In my opinion, yeah. <sighs> I'm not surprised since I, when I put the volume on TV to watch the Miller King's um, videos, um, um, what happened was I was just like randomly, I randomly stopped the. I let go of the volume button, and it's like 69 volume. I'm like, wow. Why well, I'm not surprised. That's what my life is all about. <laughs> when I, um, shoot, you know it's something when you even, like, you know, first move into your place, and the temperature says 69 on the thermostat. And it's like, oh, what's the temperature? 68, 70? Nope, 69. <laughs> and these guys, the Catmen, also, um, poison you with our physical hit if they can land them, you know? Well, I guess the seven can actually hit me pretty hard. Well, decently, but not hard, but yeah. Heal? I just want to run away from everything. Don't poison me. Last one. Wow, I'm surprised they didn't. Now, if I didn't say anything, they would have done that. Or if I had just thought about or said, you know, that they poison a lot, it wouldn't happen. I mean, it would have happened. <laughs> Alright. Terminate it and terminate it. 
All right. Got 10 minutes left of recording. Yeah, I want to try to get this challenge done. Okay. Let's go ahead and put a tent up. All right. Possession of the crown is required to test your courage. Take it to the royal throne and bring back proof of your courage. Good luck. Okay, so what we're going to do here... I don't know if I'll need the Zeus later on, so yeah. Can't run from these guys, so we're just going to destroy them. Of course, it's going to be the one that I was going to attack that runs away. Damn stupid random number generator. But yeah, these guys are stupid weak anymore. Three more. Don't run this time, buddy. Sit, sit there and, you know, no, sit there and serve your death sentence. Let me execute you real quick. Ha ha! I don't know if I should try to act like um, one of those famous YouTubers and be like, Ah, Jimmy, no! Or like, Ah, I died! So yeah, these guys are no problem. Well, you died. Oh, let's give him a two fast spells and um, let's let's charge him up with fast twice, only to see him die. These guys are stupid weak as well. Oh la, I'm gonna I'm gonna be fast, only to die to 516 points of damage. Let's go ahead and uh, grind right here. I think I got enough time to do this. I mean, they might as well have an option to, like, not use fast on me, because, um, or on themselves, because, you no, know, it's pretty bad I can take them out in one turn, like, almost 100% of the time. It's still possible for it to not happen, but, like, that would have to be, like, winning the lottery. Look at how often I can critical hit these enemies. I mean, I could hit both those guys in the same battle. Chest strike first. Terrain, that's not even a critical hit. That should tell you something right there. I don't even know how much health they have. Probably about 200, 250. I'm not so certain. But if they critical hit me, it's going to be bad. They must have about 200 health then, because 2R17 took about one shot. Hold on a second. Okay. I need to kill about four more, so yeah. Boom! Three more. Come on. Okay. Need to get one more battle and then I'll get this. No damage. Alright. One's down. Of course it's going to be the one that... Alright, what did I, I kill? That's alright. Boom! And fast ups their... Um, their hit percent. Their... Um, the amount of times... Or the... Uh, uh, how often they will, the amount of times that they hit in a, or they attempt to hit in the same turn, so yeah. Uh, run from this please. Nope. Good. There's gonna be Nightmare right on this step. One to two, I think. Or it could be up to three or four, I don't, I don't know though. Nope. Please no. Phew. They can still take me out, no problem. If they really want to, you know. Iron, ice, weapon. No, oh, this year. No. 52 hard, 29. 55 other. Okay, weapon. There we go. That is awesome. Okay. Empty. I think sometimes it's there's something in there, sometimes not. I don't know if it has to do with, um... I think you have to, like, pick that treasure chest first in that line. Otherwise, it's, uh, you don't get it. Um, you don't get anything in there. Let's go ahead and destroy these guys real quick. Five hits. That's a lot. 
Yeah, these guys are with 387 gold experience. They're not really worth it anymore. Well, in comparison to what, uh, what I'm going to show you next. No. Okay. Here we go. Two zombie dragons. Watch this. I don't even need these dudes. God, like, I can just take them out my, myself. Yeah. We can just grind right here if we... Ooh, unless that happens. Yeah, but the fact that we can critical hit off, and of course that's how I critical hit take them out in one turn, but okay. They must have exactly 300 health, because, um... I don't know. I thought they had like 350 or such. I really don't know the stats of like every enemy or a lot of them, so yeah. I swear to god, I'm about to sneeze, that's not good. Got four minutes left. That's good enough. Let's go for it again. Just two of them. Awesome. Come on, kill the zombie dragon. Let's see here, I need to kill like five more. Boom. Yeah, they have about 300 health. They have to. Because if I killed one with five hits, three are damage critical, and it dies in one turn, on that same turn. If I hadn't hit it before, yeah, they have... Well, they must have 280, because that one died to 282 damage. Well, they must, they must have... I don't even know. They must have, like, 267 or something. I don't know. I really have no idea. I'll be honest. Boom. And I level up to level 35. No. Yeah, let's just put a dead person on the top. That didn't say alright, so I apologize for that. <laughs> <sighs> alright, now that we got the Zeus gauntlet uh, weapon, no armor. I'm just going to use uh, this. Wait a second. That's better than iron, isn't it? Has to be. 5876. It is. Armor-wise, but not uh, evasion-wise, but that's alright. Alright. Let's <clears throat> save it right here. Uh, you know what? In the next video, I think we'll grind up... Uh, I'll probably, need, I'll probably uh, grind up the rest of the... Um, well, the next several videos I'll grind up, and then, um, what I'll do is, um, I'll, let's see here, what I will do is, I'll grind up, level. Well, I think I'll go grab more heals, like, pause the video right there, on the same screen, and then show you I'm not cheating, and then come back, and then, um, get to the same spot, and destroy the, actually, there's a spot in the, uh, the volcano, the gur Guru Volcano. Yeah. That you can fight those fire iguanas, whatever they are. You can destroy them, no problem. So, actually, that's a good idea. That's, I think that's what I'll do in the next video. I'll go over there and uh, fight the, um, fight that enemy. There's like two treasure chests, uh, both on the left side. I like this very small room in that um, volcano. I think about halfway, a little bit over halfway through. There's actually those spots, and they're set battles. I think you can fight up to two of them, but a lot of times just one. Well, it could be just one. I have no idea, but yeah. There was like 24-hour experience, but I don't think they're worth as much gold as these zombie dragons, but they don't hit as much, and I don't know if their ability is, you know, you know, better than, uh, or hits harder than, or takes... Inflicts more damage on you than their physical hit, but yeah. Either way, it doesn't really matter. So yeah, I'll go ahead and end the video right here. Until I'm out of 18. Peace out, everyone.